Welcome to another installment. Yes, they have enforced a St. Croix River Channel no wake safety zone on the river. This is what the bridge is going to look like when it finally crosses it. And of course, this is what it looks like today. And this is would be summer of 2013. Hello again, and this is Greg Sampson, your on the scene reporter, coming to you from Lower Oak Park Heights where the Stillwater Bridge construction is still going on. Looks just like a big build site right now. So come with me as we go across and take a look at what's going on now July of 2013 in Lower Oak Park Heights, Minnesota in the US of A just outside of Stillwater for the brand new bridge. Shall we? We shall. Yes, we are right here in the build site of this brand new Stillwater Bridge set to open in 2016. It is now summer of 2013. And as you can plainly see, ladies and gentlemen, they're bringing in the big guns right now. Once upon a time ago, this used to be part of Bayport, later changed into East Oak Park Heights. And then it was a neighborhood. This entire area here was actually residential and it was filled with houses. Well, they took out all the houses, debated back and forth, lawsuits back and forth about whether they should build or destroy the scenic wildlife, etc., etc. They have finally taken out all the houses and it is now turned into a build site here in Stillwater, Minnesota for a modern bridge to replace the bridge that is in downtown Stillwater, a lift bridge on the St. Croix River that was built in the 1930s. Let's take, come with me now as we take a look at this build site, what is now going to be the brand new Stillwater Bridge. As you can plainly see, they've brought in a lot of great heavy equipment. And of course, all this dirt here and this digging up used to be a neighborhood. I know because I went biking in this neighborhood all the time. What you're looking at over there is Bayport, Minnesota, outside of Stillwater. That big smokestack is the Northern States Power Company, where they burn coal, hence they have the gigantic smokestack. And of course, beyond these trees here is the St. Croix River. And across the St. Croix River is the state of Wisconsin. And as you can plainly see, it is now just a gigantic build site. Yes, here we are. As I said, ladies and gentlemen, they're bringing in the big guns now. It's getting serious. Soon this will be transformed in a modern bridge to take Stillwater into the 21st century will be built. As I said before, this was a residential neighborhood dating back many, many years ago, back to when it was called, well, basically South Stillwater, before Bayport even was in existence. The city of Stillwater was founded in the 1800s, and it was primarily back in those days, as you can probably tell from all this forest around here, it was a logging town and lumber barons built the city of Stillwater with these gigantic mansion-like homes, one of the neighborhoods of which we're sitting in right now. And they tried all sorts of things to get across the river from pontoon bridges to ferries, and finally put a good permanent bridge in, a lift bridge in, in the 1930s. Well, fast forward to 2013, and they're gonna come up with something even better. Yes, a brand new modern bridge, and this is the build site, and as you can see, well, they're bringing in the big guns, ladies and gentlemen. It's getting serious now. Before everything, of course, they're gonna put in all these pipes into the ground first. And that road where these cars are going on was not normally even a road. They've just dug that recently because the road went up to where that big pile of dirt is. That was the original road. Uh-oh, here come the cops. They're coming to shut down the production of Cecil B. DeMille. I better, better hurry, better hurry. <laughs> and here's another shot as we continue up the uh, embankment here. A 
Last week, in the last episode, as you may recall, we were shooting on that other side, which is actually the Wisconsin side. And as you can see, they're clearly putting the pilings into the river as we get the Stillwater Bridge going. We are now shooting on the Minnesota side where there's quite a bit more building going on at this stage, which is the early stages right now. The Wisconsin side is still basically forest. This is the existing highway that is here now, now named as Highway 36, which ends at Main Street, Stillwater. Again, this used to be a neighborhood here in Bayport, which is now named Lower Oak Park Heights in Minnesota. But soon the construction will begin on this St. Croix Bridge cruising into Wisconsin, where they've already built a freeway that goes into New Richmond, Wisconsin. Yes, I'm one of those lumber barons that is building the river bridge. How are ya? Well, we don't need that anymore. Hey, thank you so much once again for joining me with, for another installment of A Bridge to the Future as we chart the progress over the next three years all the way to 2016, it is now 2013, of the brand new Stillwater Bridge, A Bridge to the Future. Look for future installments as they come up. Here we go.